things get explosive when you fuse chemistry with coding. Here's what you'll need. Film canisters, chewing gum tubs, or small Tupperware containers. So long as they have a tight pop-on lid, they'll work. Some blue tack, fizzy and acid tablets, water. We'll be using cold, warm, and hot. We're using old film canisters, but remember, you can use the other options too. As long as the lids pop on and off, it should work. Next, fix a blob of blue tack to the inside of the lid. Now, take a tablet and press it into the blue tack. Check that it really sticks. Pour some cold water into the canister. Click the lid back on, turn it upside down and stand back. Now that's what I call a chemical reaction. So, what causes the canister to pop? A chemical reaction takes place when the water hits the sodium bicarbonate in the tablet, causing carbon dioxide gas to be released. The fizzing you're seeing is the gas escaping. As more and more carbon dioxide gas is created by the reaction, it fills up the canister and can't escape, creating loads of pressure. Eventually, the pressure gets so high, it pops the lid right off the canister, pushing against the table, sending the canister shooting into the air. Did you know that we can change things like the temperature of water and the number of tablets to speed up or slow down the reaction? Click to test these conditions like a scientist and see what happens.